Hi, this is Richard with North Texas Ball Cards, and in this video, we're going to look at the subscription box from Collectible Card Club, located here in Dallas, Texas. This is a once a month subscription box, and this one happens to be the gold level, and I believe it costs around $41, $42 a month. I've recently upgraded to the platinum package, which will be starting in April, and it will have 15 packs of cards in it. This one has 10 has 10 they range from the early 80s through to the mid to late 90s so let's take a look and see what we've got in here this time and they even give us a couple of complimentary packing peanuts all right in this stack here we've got some upper deck from 1993 we got some stadium club 1992 series 3 this one is a company I'm not familiar with. It's called Line Drive. And it looks like these are, appear to be some pre, as the pack says, pre-1991 AAA ball cards. So those might be interesting. See what, what big names we've got in there. And here's a pack of 89 Collector's Choice. I believe that's an Upper Deck. Yeah, this is Upper Deck product right there. And these are, these are some cool ones. I kind of like these. Uh, these are Sport Flix 2000 cards. There's only, th looks like, three in the pack. And when you rotate them like that, the, the image kind of changes like some of the old uh, prizes you used to get in the, in the Cracker Jack box. So it'd be kind of interesting to see what's in those. I've got a few of those in my PC already. And over here we've got 91 Upper Deck. Fleer Ultra 91. Fleer 1983, these ones I'm, I'm really interested in. So I think we'll probably do those last. And I think this is 87 Donruss, if I'm not mistaken. Let's see if there's anything on here. Yeah, 26 1997 Donruss King uh, prints. So we'll put that there. And we also have some 81 Donruss. So so these ones, these, we'll do these ones last. All right, let's get the, the Sport Flix ones out of, out of the way first. Let's, let's do those and see what's in there. Ooh, got a Wade Boggs in there, maybe, possibly. Uh, Major League, uh, that's expired. I don't think we need to worry about that anymore. Let's see, what do we got? Oh, cool. And that is Bruce Hurst. That's kind of neat. And Vince Coleman. I like these. I, at first, I wasn't sure if I was going to. And here's a couple of, looks like, uh, National League logo uh, minis. There's that one. And, ooh, an exposed mini. The team doesn't even exist anymore. And, ah, here is the Wade Boggs. So those are kind of cool. We'll put those aside. Maybe I'll put those on a website. And uh, if you're for those of you that aren't, you should really look at Trading Card Database. That's a really good online tool for keeping track of your inventory. And uh, so I might put those on there. So if anybody's interested in trading, we might be able to work something out. Uh, this pack is 1989 Upper Deck. Ooh, Oral Hershiser. Oral Hershiser, not a bad one. Cecilio Guante. I'm, I apologize in advance for butchering these names because I'm, I'm terrible at even with my own name. Okay, uh, let's see if I get that spotlight out of the way. There. I, yeah, there. That's better. Ozzy Guillen. Ozzy Guillen. He's, he's, that might be a good one for the PC. Rob Murphy. <laughs> Jim Pankovitz. Jim Pankovitz. Oh, that's hurt. I'm a dork. I'm a dork. I'm a dork. I'm a dork. And he kind of got a dork looking face. Okay. Jeff Stone of the Orioles. Ken Gerhardt. Ken Gerhardt with the Orioles. He's he's was not bad in his day. 
Ooh, some stickers. We also got, oh, Texas Ranger sticker. I'll be hanging on to that, on to that one. Uh, the Giants, uh, probably not so much. We'll hang on to that to that uh, Texas Ranger sticker. Ah, I kind of like that. We also have Mike Felder. And Jose Sasena. Like I said, I apologize in advance for butchering the names. And Junior Felix. Tim Burke. Gerald Perry. I've got a few of his cards in my from various years. Chuck Finley and Al Leiter. I've got his, I think it's 87 or 88 uh, tops card that is an error that has the wrong guy's picture on it. So embarrassing when that happens. Put that one off to the side. And ooh, how about we do the, the AAA one? The pre-rookie, pre-1991 rookie. So let's, let's see what's in here. Maybe there'll be somebody who later became a Hall of Famer. Ah, Kurt Ford. I've recognized him from some of the cards. Here's where he played with the Toledo Mud Hens. <laughs> Funny names for some of these uh, teams. Don Vels Vessling. Never heard of him. Also with the Mud Hens. Chris Myers from the Roch Rochester Red Wings. Jeff Johnson. Darren Chapin. That one kind of sounds familiar, but I'm not real sure. Keith Helton. No, don't think I know him. Van Snyder. Don't think I know him either. Chuck Malone from the Scranton Wilkes Barry Boost Bar Red Barons. Now, here's a name I am familiar with uh, Andy Ashby. He later played with the Astros, if I'm not mistaken. Gary Wilson, don't know him. Julius McDougal, don't know him. Tracy Woodson. Tracy Woodson. That one kind of sounds familiar, but I'm not sure where. So I might have to do a little research and see what he is. So we got the, the Andy Ashby one. Now, that's the one, that's the only one I recognize. Okay, and let's go for the Top Stadium Club 1992. I'm bad with knowing who, what player comes out in what year, so a lot of times I do have to look it up. So I have to look it up in something like Trading Card Database, which is a really good really good site, as I said earlier. Jim Jim Bullinger. Like I say, I'm, I'm going to butcher the name, so let's just get that out of the way now. Chris Gwynn. I uh, don't know if he's related to Tony Gwynn or not. I think I've read somewhere that he might be. Might be a brother or something. Scott Geraltz. I've, I've heard of him. Dennis Rasmussen. Rasmussen. I've heard of him also. Joe McGrain. Know him. Mike Witt from the Yankees. I've heard of him too. So some of these guys were, were playing when I was a boy, and that's a long time ago. And I don't think we need the 1992 Top Stadium Club membership. Eddie Murray. Now, that's a good one. That one would be one for the PC. We we'll have to look that one up and see what see what he's what he might be worth these days. Same with Dave Winfield. He was a big name with the Yankees back in the, in the 80s and 90s. Frank Viola, Jeff Parrott, Kurt Stillwell, Jack Dockery, Dockerty, Daryl Kyle, and Eddie Taubenze. Eddie Taubenze, I've seen him on a few of them. So there's a couple of ones I might have to hang on to in here. So put those away that over there okay how about we go for 93 upper deck season one like i said the pack that this these came in the uh 
collectible card club pack that this came in this year, uh, this month. Uh, I upgraded to the 15 card, 15 pack platinum uh, box, and that'll be starting next month. Okay, upper deck, Mike Trombley. Wally Joyner, oh, team card. George Brett, I recognize him in there. Wally Joyner, George Brett, and Greg Jeffries. And Dave Malicki. Hope I pronounced that right. Dave Malicki. I'm going to flip over to this side. Carlos Garcia. John Valentine. Valentine. Travis Fryman and Mike Sharperson, Jose Lind, Jose Offerman. We got two stuck there. Ben McDonald. Paul Sorrento, Leo Gomez, some of these are bricked together, there we go, we got them separated, Billy Ripken, I still want that uh, 89 Fleer with the, with the, we'll call it an error on there, I still want to get a hold of those, uh, one of those, Doug Jones, and Lou Whitaker, a couple of decent ones out of there too we might have to keep put that right over there and how about we go for some Fleer Ultra 1991 what do we got here oh we got a sticker how about a Baltimore Orioles sticker yay not really my team, but we'll hang on to it. Francisco Cabrera. Rob Dibble. For being packed up since they were the day they were come out, these are still in remarkably good condition. Junior Naboa. Robbie Thompson. Chuck Knobloch. He's, I recognize him. I think he later on goes to play for the Yankees, if I'm not mistaken. Leo Gomez. Ah, there's Tony Gwynn. Yeah, we'll definitely hang on. Oh, here's another one. Yeah, Randy Johnson. It's not his rookie card, I don't believe. Let's see. Uh, says he played for the Mariners in 90, so I think 89 was his rookie year. Will Clark. Oh, Daryl Strawberry with the Dodgers. Yeah, we'll be hanging on to this one, too. That'll go into PC. And Steve Decker, Brian Harvey, Terry Templeton, and Jimmy Key. Okay, so yeah, there, there's a couple more to add. We'll put those, pull those aside later on. All right, and this pack is 1991 Upper Deck. So I don't, I don't, I'm getting into the new ones, the Mike Trout and uh, Shohei Otani and uh, some of the more popular ones that are out now, but I still, I still like the old school. Now, this is the one where I think we're looking for the Ken Griffey Jr. If we can find one of those, ta-da, that will get sent into PSA. Tom Bolton with the Red Sox. I'm not even going to try that one. Scott Champerino. Hopefully I didn't butcher that too bad, Scott. If you're listening by any chance, let me know. <laughs> okay, Jeff Schultz with the Royals. Oh, and another team. Ooh, a nice chrome-looking sticker. Expos or refractor or something. I don't, I'm not much into the Topps chrome and all those. That's just, just not my thing. I'm the old school. I like just the regular picture cards. Brian Harper. Fred Lynn, old-timer there. He's been around for a while. Tom Foley, him too. Jeff Hewson. 
Mark McGuire, 91. Not his rookie card, but he still weighs a buck oh five in this one. And <laughs> yeah, I'm not gonna say he used any PEDs, but hey, you know, we'll just let you be the judge. David Wells. I think I remember him, not too much though. Scott Erickson, Pete Harnish. And we're almost done with this deck. Carl Rhodes. ODB McDowell. I think he later plays with the Rangers, if I'm not mistaken. And Jack Morris. So let's say, look how good some of these cards are picture wise. Just, I mean, for being boxed up since 1991, 30 years these things have been boxed up and they're still in amazing condition. All right, we're down to our last three packs. 81 Donruss. Let's go with that. Oh, this one's damaged. Oh, no, that's his hair. <laughs> I think these had a whole bunch of errors in it, if I'm not mistaken. Oh, yuck, yuck, yuck. Oh, these still had the gum on it. Oh, damn. If you want some gum, you have some gum, free to, I'll free to any member, any subscriber that wants it. Oh, so hopefully that's nobody. Oh, Toby Hera. I would have liked to have had that one not destroyed, but... Oh, well, we'll put him aside. Let's see who else we got. Earl Weaver. It's got a little bit of wax on there, but I know how to get that off there. Larry Wilburn. Yankees. But he's got... That is an error card, because that's a Mariner's logo larry milburn so we'll, we'll put him away he's an error card nelson norman carlos lescano we start checking all the names to make sure denny martinez orioles and orioles bob pate expos it's got a little bit of blemish on it right there Ken Wrights, the Cardinals. Dwayne Cooper with the Indians. Woody Fryman with the Expos. Marty Patton with the Royals. Al Bumbry with the Orioles. Lenny Randall. Mike Edwards. Jim Tracy. Here's another error, I think. Jeff Zahn says the Angels. That eh, looks like twins to me. So we'll, we'll put him aside. Dave Stapleton. And Jesus Figueroa. Giants and Cubs. I don't know if these were just... I believe these are going to be error cards. So we're going to... We'll, we'll put these in our little super secret stash that the wife don't know about. And not much I can do with that one. That's got gum damage on it. Oh, well. Still some good ones in here, though. All right. Let's see what's in the 87 Donruss. Let's kind of clean up the mess a little bit so we don't have to clean up so much later. And puzzle piece. I think this was a Roberto Clemente puzzle. Yes, it was. 87 Donners. We've got Bill Schroeder, Chet Lemon, Brett Butler, Shane Raleigh. There's Mr. Sharperson again. We saw him earlier. Pat Perry, Tom Brookins with that mustache. That's the porn stash there. J, uh, John uh, Miserock. I guess that's how it's pronounced. Steve Lake, Jerry Brown, rated rookie, Vince Coleman, Dave Regal, oh yeah, here we go, Nolan Ryan, yep, we'll be hanging on to that one, definitely put that one in the super secret stash, Gino Petrali, and Bob Brinley, so yeah, I think the Nolan Ryan makes this one, puts this one in the hit column. Those right there. 
Put that over here. Okay, the last pack for this box, 1983 Fleer. This one doesn't feel to have like it has any gum in it. So hopefully there's nobody important here on the back that would have got a wax stain. Oh, nice tiger sticker. Kind of faded, but hey, still looks kind of neat. All right. Paul Householder. Don't know him. Brian Smith. Whoops. Onyx Concepcion. Don't really know him, but might have to do a little research. Rick Ownby. Jerry Morales. Dick Tidro. Ron Ronicky. Don't know. Your guess is as good as mine on that one. Feel free to correct me in the in the comments. Rick Leach. Ivan DeJesus. Brett Butler. Look at that hair. Bob Watson. Luis Pujols. I wonder if he's related to Luis Pujols. It's probably just a fairly common name. Luis Pujols. And Bill Narodny. For the engines. And the last two are Ed Romero and Dan Ford. Look at those 80s glasses. Wow. That, that was style back then. Okay, well, we had some hits and we had some misses. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do some research into these errors right here. See what they're looking for, what they're going for right now, or see if they're really errors or if there's some other reason why the team names and the, and the picture doesn't match. All right. Well, feel free to comment on on the pack tell me what you thought if, you, if you've got anything you're looking to trade for any of these uh you can e email me or you can look me up at richard s in fwtx on trading card database and find me there uh thanks for watching everybody we will see y'all again on the next pack which will probably the, be the subscription box from the big bat box so until next time we'll see y'all later